Hello, this is Raymond the Meta Man with maybe the most important video I've ever done because I have figured out a way to get a hundred X. I figured out a way to find hundred X hidden gems that are under the radar and I'm going to reveal how I do it and the actual 10 coins that I found that I'm going to buy right after I finish this video so that you can run in and get them in before me. But maybe you don't want to play this video on how I find the hundred X. Maybe you just want to get some 100x that I've talked about before and see how they've done, then go right here to my other video on 100x and play that instead. But if you're still here, it's because you want to know how I find 100x gems so that at any time, next year, two years from now, you can use this process and find your own 100x under the radar gems. There are four rules that I follow, four. Here they are. Number one, I choose a category that is brand new and about to explode. Brand new and about to explode. And what is that category? Meta, the metaverse, because it's brand new. Hardly anyone even knew about it until the very end of October, 2021, when Mr. Mark Zuckerberg announced that he's changing the name of Facebook to Meta and people said, what? They're scratching their head. What the heck is going on? So it's a new category, very, very exciting. The second is it must be low cap, low, low cap. Low cap means low capitalization. In other words, for example, um, Bitcoin has a market cap of $1 trillion. If you multiply all the 18 and a half million Bitcoins there are by the price of a coin, about $60,000, you come out to about a trillion dollars. But the coins that I'm looking at are like 5 million, 10 million, 30 million. They're really, really low cap. Now, the disadvantage is they can fall to zero. So you have to invest only what you can afford to lose. But the good news is because they're so tiny, if any interest whatsoever, if any interest whatsoever comes to that coin, it'll skyrocket because then it can easily go up 50X or 100X. That's what I'm excited about. And that's why I did this research and that's why I'm revealing it to you. So I've told you two rules. It has to be in the metaverse and it has to be low cap. Third, it has to be on one of the exchanges that I'm already on. I'm on Binance, Gate.io, and Kraken. Those are my three exchanges. And I don't want to have a proliferation of dozens and dozens of exchanges. So if it's on one of those exchanges, I'll accept it. If it's not, it's not worth it for me. And, and finally, it has to have a good entry point. That's technical analysis. It has to have a good entry point on the graph. Now, let me show you what's in store for you. Let me show you. You'll love this. Let's look at Phantasma, S-O-U-L. You can see that it started its life May 27th of 2018. You can see that on the top right of the graph. And it did basically nothing for years. And then it moved up a little and fell down. And then it just went parabolic. And it went parabolic roughly when Mr. Mark Zuckerberg made his announcement of the metaverse. And that's what I'm looking forward to. I'm looking forward to buying coins that haven't shot up yet. They're just lazing around doing roughly nothing. And then it could be Mark Zuckerberg making another Facebook metaverse announcement. It could be Amazon making a metaverse announcement. It could be Microsoft or it could be Google making a Microsoft announcement. Or it could be somebody else. Or it could be President Biden saying that he's invested in coins in the metaverse. Who knows? But when anything like that happens, then the coins that I'm recommending, the coins that I found, the coins that I'm going to be telling you in this video are the ones that are low cap so they can explode. So this particular one went from about 10 cents to about three and a half dollars. Well, that's 35x in a couple of weeks, 35x in a couple of weeks. And that's not the only one. Let's look at another one. Let's look at Arcona, A-R-C-O-N-A. You can see that it started its life February 25th, 2019. And all the way to today, for most of that time, it did nothing. Then it got a little excited. And then sure enough, as soon as Mark Zuckerberg made its announcement, the coin just went berserk. It went from about 10 cents to over $2. That's 20X in a day, 20X in a day. That's what's going to be available to you. And this is what's going to happen when everybody gets excited about the metaverse. When somebody makes some big, gigantic announcement, then all the coins will go up. But the little ones, the little cap, the smallest cap coins are going to go up the most. 
you can see Senso, S-E-N-S-O. It went from maybe 10 cents to about $3. That's 30X in how long? In a couple of weeks, 30X in a couple of weeks. That's the kind of thing that I'm looking for and much, much more. So my very first one going from lowest cap to highest cap is called Shufi, S-H-O-E. Now Shufi, you can see it started around 70 cents and then it fell to 20 cents. And now it's just kind of lazing around doing roughly nothing. And you can see it's at a low. It's 43 cents right now. I will buy it as soon as I finish making this video. What's its market cap? It's so low that coingecko.com can't even figure it out. And its market cap is so low, it's probably 3,000 or 4,000 on the list. So why am I buying this? Because it's in the metaverse. It has a very low market cap. It is on an exchange that I'm on and it has a great entry point. It's as simple as that, as simple as that. Although it took me hours to find it. The next one is, I don't even know how to pronounce it, Kaleo and it's K-L-O. So you can see that this one started its life September 27th, 2021. You can see that on the top right of the graph and it went up a little and then went sideways, then went up a little, and now it's been going sideways for several months. That's what I like, a coin that is just not doing anything interesting. And you can see that the very all-time lowest at the very bottom right of the screen was about 30 cents and the all-time highest was $1.84. And right now it's halfway between at 95 cents. Very nice, sitting there doing not much of anything, I like this coin. I'm buying it as soon as I finish this video recording. Now, the next one is Revamon, R-E-V-O. Now, normally I wouldn't buy one that has already just gone up, but it's gone up and it's fallen back about half. So I can see that in July, it tried to go up. And then in November, it did go up, but it fell back again. And so I'm, I'm realizing that this one's got some interest behind it. And so I'm going to take a chance on this one. Now, it didn't start its life until April 11th of 2021. So it's got no history. It's very young. It's very new. And this might drop to zero, as I told you, but it may go 100x. Now, remember, this is for education and entertainment only. And by the way, you might be loyal to Sandbox. And really, if you just wanna learn about Sandbox, why don't you just go right there and learn about Sandbox? But if you're interested, then stay with me and learn about the next one that I'm gonna be buying as soon as I finish this video. And it's called Binamon, B-M-O-N. And you can see that its entire lifetime didn't start until June 14th of this year, 2021. So we only have a half a year of information about it. And it started its life really low at about a half of a cent. And it's sitting at 22 cents right now, but it's been up to almost 80 cents. So it's basically for the last half year or so, just sitting there doing not much of anything. And you can see that it has a very low market cap of only 35 million and it's 824th on the list. That's very, very low. The next one that I'm buying as soon as I finish this recording is Rev, R-E-V-V. It's a, it's an, it's a racing game, a, a, an automobile racing game. And you can see that it started its life in September 5 of 2020. So it's been around for a little over a year and it tried to go up in April. There must have been some big news and then it fell back down. Then it tried to go up in August and then fell back down. And then it did go up a bit when Mark Zuckerberg made his announcement and now it looks like it's falling back down. So you might say, well, if it looks like it's falling back down, why don't you wait a week or two? And the answer is it hardly matters. If I buy now, and it only goes up 50X instead of 100X because it might've fallen by half, I don't care. These are throwaway stocks. These are ones I'm not buying a lot of. I'm not buying 10,000, 50,000, $100,000 worth of it. I'm buying under $5,000. That's my level of comfort. But you only might want to invest $100 on each one. 100 times 10 coins is $1,000. Maybe your risk aversion is that you don't want to blow more than $1,000. Okay, fine. If all 10 of them go to zero, you've lost your thousand dollars. 
or maybe you'll buy $500 worth of each. 500 times 10 is $5,000. Now you've got a variety of coins. So if one or two or five of them go to zero, but the others go 50X or 100X or 500X, you are way, way, way in the good. And that's why I've added Rev, R-E-V-V, to my list. The next one is Eternity, E-R-N. And you can see that it started its life March 7th of this year. So it's only got about nine months of history. And when it landed in the universe, it shot up and then fell back down and it's been doing nothing. That's what I love. It's been doing absolutely nothing. Occasionally there's a little bit of volume, but it doesn't do anything. And you can see that its market cap is 137 million. So that's not really terribly low, but you can see its rank is 424th. So it's still a long way from the top 100, a long way from the top 10. It's a very small market cap coin and I'm adding it. The next one is DeFi land, DFL. And you can see it started its life November 24 of this year. It's only been around for a couple weeks, a couple weeks. And it's basically sitting there doing nothing. It's just edging to the right, not going up or down, just lolling around. It has 108, 180 million market cap, but its rank is really low, 376. So you can see its all-time low is 19 cents and its all-time high is 42 cents. And it's sitting somewhere in the middle, actually exactly in the middle at 31 cents right now. I'm buying it. I'm going to sleep like, uh, who's that Who's that character in Disney? That lady who fell asleep for a long time? Sleeping Beauty, yes. I'm gonna, I don't know how long she fell asleep, 100 years, but I'm not gonna fall asleep for 100 years. But I am gonna fall asleep as far as these 10 coins are concerned, not till the big boom, but till the next boom. So the boom could come in the first quarter of 2022, and then the next boom might be in 2024. And in 2024, some of these 10 coins are gonna be in the top 10 or the top 100, and they will have mooned 100X or 500X. And some of them will have fallen to zero, as I've explained to you. Remember, this is for education and entertainment only. I will be adding DeFi land to my list of 10 coins. The next is Avagachi, Avagachi. And its uh, call letters are G-H-S-T, like, like as if it's ghost. And you can see that it started its life December 1st of 2021. And it's now December 2nd of 2021. Are you noticing this? It started its life yesterday, just yesterday. And it's sitting there doing basically nothing except falling a little. So you can see that the all-time low is 49 cents, the all-time high is $3, and it's sitting now at $2.83. It's just gliding sideways. I'm buying it, I'm going to sleep for a few years. When I wake up, it'll be worth a fortune or zero. The next one is Star Atlas, which has the call letters P-O-L-I-S, and you can see that that one has a $231 million market cap and its rank is 320th and it's just gliding sideways. It's just gliding sideways. And that's what I like. It started its life September 1st of 2021. It's now December 2nd of 2021. It's only been around for a few months and it hasn't done anything. Maybe because it's worthless and deserves to drop to zero or maybe because they're getting their act together and they're inviting developers and they're making strategic alliances and they're getting funding. But I think that if they succeed, this will be 100X. If they don't succeed, it'll be zero. And I'm prepared for one or two or three of them to go to zero and for a few of them to go up 3X, 7X, 14X, and for two or three of them to go up 100X to 500X. And that's why I'm doing this video and that's why I'm making these 10 investments as soon as I finish the video so that you get the information first. And now for the 10th and final one is Yield Guild Games, YGG. And that one is just not exactly what I want. You can see it's rising and it's a little higher than I want, 
But the reason I'm buying it is because of the some of the gurus that I follow talked about how wonderful is the business model of YGG. So I'm putting that into the list because I've got some fundamental wisdom about it, not just technical knowledge. Those are my 10. I wish you the best of success. You can buy all 10. You can buy none of them. But remember, don't buy them based on my recommendation because I'm not making a recommendation. This is just for education and entertainment. And now an important announcement. Hello, and thank you for listening to that exciting video. Now, click on Meta in order to subscribe so that other people will enjoy it too. And click right here to enjoy my previous video and click right there in to enjoy the video about SAND, my favorite crypto metaverse coin.